is key. I am here because I am all out of my favorite oil, my swag oil mix. And so I have got to make some more and I figured I might as well make some on camera so that you could see what ingredients I use. And you might decide you wanna to try to make some swag oil for yourself. Um, I have a color applicator bottle that I got from Sally's. Um, this one has um, six ounces. Um, these are the ingredients that I would use. I just love these oils. I think that they are just fantastic for the hair and for moisture. I use this on my scalp all the time. I use it to seal in moisture. Um, I use it for shine. I just use this oil, you know, pretty much on a daily basis, whether my hair is dry or wet. Um, even while my hair is flat ironed, I'm not using any kind of creams or liquids this week because I want to keep my hair straight, but I am definitely putting oil on it every single day. So these are the oils that I use. I use um, coconut oil, um, virgin coconut oil, and grapeseed oil. A little EVOO. Now, those three oils are um, my favorites, especially coconut oil. That is my top, top, top favorite oil. Um, I love the way it smells, the consistency of it. It just is amazing. My glasses are disgusting. Give me just a second. At any rate, I think coconut oil is just the best oil and the thing that I really like about those oils is that they're not terribly expensive and because they are relatively inexpensive I use them in high concentrations so I'm going to be putting in an ounce and a half of each one of those oils now when you buy coconut oil it's hardened you know coconut oil needs some heat in order to to liquefy so I just scooped out a couple of spoonfuls into a container, stuck it in the microwave for 15, 20 seconds to just melt it down because I, I can't pour it and measure it um, in its solid state. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna put in 1.5 ounces of each of those oils. Those are my top three favorites. Got my coconut, my olive, and my grapeseed oils in equal quantities. So now that I've put in my big three, I'm gonna go down to my next two, vegetable glycerin, which is the only non-oil that I'll be using, and my Jamaican black castor oil. Um, I use the vegetable glycerin as a humectant to pull in moisture and, and retain moisture. I try a scented JBCO, you might really like it. All right, so here we go with a half ounce of the vegetable glycerin. And so now I need a half ounce of the JBCO. It says it nourishes, prevents breakage, adds sheen and moisture. See that added a nice brown color. And a lot going on in here. Look at all these different layers, that's crazy. Okay, and so as you can see, I'm almost at the six ounce mark. And so what I do to help finish those six ounces is I add my favorite essential oils. And those four essential oils are tea tree to help with the scalp, making sure your scalp is not dry and flaky. Um, it helps keep it nice and clean. So I'm gonna put in uh, about 10 drops of tea tree oil. Another 10 drops of rosemary. That also helps stimulate the scalp very well. Lavender, you know, I'm sure lavender has some great qualities, but quite frankly, I'm using it because I love the smell of lavender. I think it's really soothing, helps me sleep well, and I usually use my swag oil at night, so I gotta have a little lavender in there. And last but not least, is a capful or about 10 drops of some vitamin E oil. And that's all I put in my swag oil. Um, you know, when you first invest in all these oils, it's going to be like, whoa, whoa, that's a little expensive. I'm not going to lie to you. But um, I've had these oils, most of them, since I went natural two and a half years ago. So I'm not having to replace them frequently. And um, 
when I make my swag oil, it usually lasts for about six months. So you are making an investment in your hair and it's moisture. So I think it's worth it. Shake, 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 shake. As my daughter would say. That's her favorite thing right now. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. And with that, I am at six ounces. And I've got a good six months worth of swag ready to be used on my scalp. Um, as you can tell, I've got some separation. So before I use my swag oil in the morning and at night, I just quickly turn it over, turn it back, turn it over, turn it back. And I might do that three or four different times until it starts to look like a amber colored liquid all the way through. And that's when I apply it. Well, if you have any questions about my swag oil mix, um, let me know. I got my products at Earth Fair, Whole Foods, Trader Joe's. Um, might have been a couple of times I ordered on Amazon. But lately I've noticed that Walmart is carrying a lot more stuff. So check out your local grocery store, especially if it has an organic section. Um, that might be really helpful to, for finding things on the ground. But um, that's all guys. Thanks so much for watching. And um, let me know if you tried this swag oil and if it works out for you. All right, guys. Talk to you later. Bye, y'all.